Pandora's Promise came out and they're, they're talking about the fast reactor. Is there any uptick in interest in this now? I think it has uh, motivated some people who had been either skeptical of nuclear or, or were anti-nuclear to rethink. So I'm Robert Stone. I'm the director of Pandora's Promise, which is a documentary that chronicles the conversion of a number of high-profile environmentalists from being anti-nuclear to pro-nuclear. And their process of conversion on this issue very much mirrors my own. On opening night, I polled the audience. I was surprised that 20% actually admitted to being pro-nuclear at Sundance, but they, they raised their hands, Q&A after the film, and I asked the same question. And that was the response. Until Pandora's Promise in 2013, there was no compelling video explanation of the liquid metal reactor's safety test for the public to digest. That same year, a video of molten salt researchers was posted to YouTube explaining how the molten salt reactor experiment safely compensated for an equipment malfunction thanks to the passive safety enabled by molten salt. Molten salt is inherently safe and, you know, self-controlling. 